Join the dark order. This is a tag team bout set for one fall with a 20 minute time limit. Introducing first from the keep at a combined weight of 439 pounds, Stu Grayson, Evil Uno, Dark Order. Well, Taz, we heard from the Dark Order on Wednesday night at Dynamite. The exalted one is near. We will soon find out the identity of this mysterious figurehead at the top yeah. of this organization. Uh, it's been it's seemingly forever. We're still waiting to find out who the exalted one is. Who is this, this grand high exalted mystic ruler? Who is it? And everyone keeps saying he, he, he. That's Maybe true. it's a she. Could be. Maybe it's a she. I heard you recently say he, Excalibur. I heard you say he. You're right. You're I heard right. you. I heard you. And the Dark Order will be in action tomorrow night at Revolution against Frankie Kazarian, Scorpio Sky, SCU. And they said that they are going to send a message. Shoot, Chris. You gotta, gotta lay out. Taz, he can shush me. You can't, man. Why? We're friends. Uh, pardon me, I said shh. Kansas City, Missouri. A lot of Braves fan here tonight. <laughs> what a place Florida known State. for its uh, lousy barbecue. Yeah. It's also referred to as the city of fountains. Today, I tossed a coin in that fountain, made a wish that I would never come back to this dump again. That's funny, I did the exact same thing. <laughs> Peter, stop insulting every city we come to. You know what? I picked the perfect book for you. Don't be a dick. I think I read that in middle school. No, you never read it. I can guarantee it. Ah, oh, man. My you hit a home run off that team. <laughs> and joining Peter Avalon from Tokyo, Japan, weighing 203 pounds, Michael Naka. Naka. Naka! one of those Michael Nakazawa shirts. Well, you can go to shopaew.com and get your Michael Nakazawa shirt. We've got a special sale going on this weekend in honor of AEW Revolution. And now we have this unlikely pairing of Michael Nakazawa and the librarian Peter Avalon as they went say in Mexico, Pareja Incredible. And Stu Grayson and Evil Uno though, very focused, not letting the antics of uh, of the librarians or the Turkish oil wrestling specialist Michael Nakazawa get under their skin. There's the uh, and that, said oil, the baby oil Jones. Yeah, there we go. It's not just baby oil, Taz. It is Turkish oil. Oh, Turk, my bad. No, 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 no. I don't want none of that comedy, hearty, hearty, hard crap. I don't think so. Come here. Come here. Come here! I'm gonna show. Come here! I'm gonna show you traditional wrestling, Just take punching, kicking, holds, all that stuff. You ready? You slipped on the, the Turkish essential oils. Those are essential oils, right? Well, they Turk. They, they're actually inessential. The inessential Turkish oils. And he's showering himself in the oils, Nakazawa. And oh, but Stu Grayson just run him over. Those crop chops, those cross chops across the throat. And born and bred for combat. Stu Grayson muscling Michael Nakazawa into the corner. Web reversals, and now Uno with the big splash in the corner. Wow. Grayson follows it up, and the boot cover one. 
two. Nope, Nakazawa kicks out. See how quick, this is what I love about Uno and I love about Grayson, how quick they turned things up Excalibur and just turned everything towards their side and the beatdown they put on Nakazawa and how quick they did it, very impressive. And Nakaz Nakazawa has been, uh, he's been offered a Dark Order membership by, uh, by Uno and Grayson. And I believe they, they're using that as a way to get at Kenny Omega. The Dark Order still trying to flush out their ranks here. Well, they've been recruiting after going after everybody. And if you turn them down, they want to just chop you up. And you're seeing that happen right now to Nakazawa to the point you just made, Excalibur. Peter Avalon wants no part of Stu Grayson. But, oh, that hammer, that sledgehammer shot across the spine. Yeah, clubbing strong forearm. And now maybe a vertical suplex or well, blocked by Nakazawa or whatever. Maybe. Nakazawa trying to keep his base low. He's Nakazawa's digging. Oh, he's got the oil. Oh, oh wow. He had That's backup oil. <laughs> guy's got a lot of oil. Oh. oh, he slipped off. He went for the suplex. <laughs> so he was too slick, the head of Nakazawa. Avalon. Well, Avalon don't want no part of the of the uh, the oil. Oh. Ha ha Jones, he don't want no part of that. And Grayson has Nakazawa up on the shoulders. He's got him set up for the nightfall. Oh, my God. Oh, 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 just oh, broke geez. him in half. Nightfall for sure. What a just an inverted backbreaker that was just brutal. And now Uno has Nakazawa all hooked up. Grayson up top. Fatality. Cover that one. That is it. Wow. And Avalon just left Nakazawa to himself. Just what Sean Spears did to Avalon last week on Dark. The winners of this match, Dark Order. And the Dark Order looking impressive heading in to this matchup tomorrow night at Revolution with SCU, the former AEW World Tag Team Champions, as Uno still continuing that recruiting drive. Well, yeah, maybe Michael Nakazawa should reconsider. Maybe he should join the Dark Order, just, just my opinion. And John Silver, Alex Reynolds, the other two men that have taken the offer, and you can see right there that crescent-shaped momentum from Stu Grayson was all it yep. took to put away Michael Nakazawa. High stack pin, the rest is fundamental.